don't make life harder than what it needs to be. Like when it comes to relationships, when it comes to friendships, when it comes to your career opportunities, your career choices, like all the things in life, all you have to really know and understand is what you don't want in life. Like sometimes we focus so much on trying to figure out what we do want that we end up stressing ourselves out. We end up feeling depressed. We end up feeling anxious. We end up like losing ourselves in the process of that. And I think that's because like sometimes the things you do want, you can't get those things. Or the things that you do want, they don't want you back. And that's gonna happen sometimes. Like you're gonna like want certain things that don't want you. You're gonna want a certain individual that doesn't feel the same way. You're gonna want this job that doesn't want you. Like that's normal, that's life. But I think for me, like, my life started to change and life started to become a lot more peaceful and a lot more easier when I started to understand and know what I don't want instead of trying to figure out what I do want. Because I know for a fact I don't want a relationship where the person is a horrible communicator. I don't want a relationship where the person doesn't express their feelings, isn't open, isn't open-minded. Like, I don't want a relationship where a person is always arguing, being negative. Like, that's what I don't want in a relationship. So I'm gonna close all those doors. All those things I don't want, I'm shutting all those doors. So that now I'm only left with what I do want. I eliminated all the things in life for a relationship that I don't want. So now I'm only left with what? The things I do want. So that just narrowed that thing down for me for relationships. Now let's talk about friendships. Friendships, I don't want someone that is distant all the time. I don't want someone that I only talk to one time a year. I don't want someone that lies to me. I don't want someone that's wishy-washy. I don't want someone that isn't honest with me, doesn't open up to me, that isn't open-minded. Like, these are things that I don't want when it comes to a friendship. So now I'm only left with what? The things I do want, which is someone that is honest, which is someone that does open up and is open-minded, which is someone that does express how they feel or express what's on their mind. Like I'm only left with those things because I closed all the doors in my life of the things I don't want when it comes to a friendship. Like. It's literally that simple, bro. Stop making life harder than what it needs to be. Stop stressing yourself out. Stop making yourself feel depressed. Stop making yourself feel anxious. Like, a lot of the things you go through in life is all self-created. It's all self-inflicted. If you just take a step back and start to, like, navigate your life properly, if you start to, like, take a step back and just look at things from an elevated perspective, it's like things will become a lot more simpler. They'll become a lot more easier. If you just start to take a step back, slow things down and process things the right way. So that's what I want you to do, man. After watching this video, even right now, you can start the video right now if you want to. I won't even be mad, but start the video and start focusing on the things you don't want in a relationship. Start focusing on the things you don't want in a friendship. And once you figure out what you don't want in a friendship or relationship, close all those doors. So now you're only left with the doors of the things you do want. If somebody walks through that door, that means they'll be a good friend. That means they'll be a good partner for a relationship because all the things I don't want in life for a friendship or relationship, those doors are closed. So whoever walks through these open doors, they might be for me. Like, that's how you gotta look at shit. That's how I look at it, and I'm going to leave it at that. Make sure you like and share this video with someone who needs to hear this, and make sure you subscribe to the channel for more. I'm sending peace, sending love, sending blessings as always. Elevate.